Match is a set. My brother name is Tina Dollar. Stop all that back and forth over the net. My mama wish I would've went corporate. She wish I would've went exec. I still turn to a CEO, so the lifestyle she respect. Hey, two sprinters to Quebec. Chevy Uemo. Yo, we are in Vegas. Y'all know this is like my favorite place to visit, so we just got here. We're about to go make play on some slots and waste some time because our room, of course, is not ready yet. So, yeah. Cheers. Now I do like it like that with the shirt. Look at my history. I'm trying to see what's different from that guy in the rich of me. The only thing I see is custom miles from Tiffany and some gunners that are hit you out of nowhere like a Tiffany. Really, that's it to me. Aside from the obvious, man, the changes in scenery. Testing me, gonna have my niggas testing machinery. They say that they happy, my man, that's not how they seem to be. The boy, he wild and peaceful. Rest in peace, Tina Marie. Ethics and values, my traditions, old fashioned, monopoly action. Ronnie buying up print, but like he's still in Akron. A lot of pain, a lot of passion, a lot of relaxing while other niggas is overreacting. That's how we continue down the path of Jordan and Jackson. That's some insight for y'all, even if no one's asking. Last year, niggas really feel like they rolled on me. Last year, niggas got hot because they turned on me. They've got his next drink. Was it your third or fourth drink today? Yeah, right. Good. Yeah. 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 <laughs> when in Vegas, drink. Y'all, I'm almost done, but uh, I'm getting a headache, so I'm probably just make this my last for now. Hey, y'all. Good morning. So, yesterday, I did not talk to y'all that much um, because I was just trying to, you know, have a good little time and take it easy. You know, anytime you travel to like the west coast and you're in this different time zone it just throws you off wow so i'm sorry i'm telling on my hair products and i see something spilled okay, whatever. um so yeah i'm up early because obviously <laughs> i am used to it being eight o'clock right now instead of five o'clock um so i'm just up and yesterday my hair got so frizzy i really don't know why because you know here it's dry heat but it was probably just in the midst of like traveling and sweating and all of that um stuff so i'm about to try to revive it i have no plans of washing my hair while i'm here so i definitely need to just get it back you know get it back going um, yeah, it doesn't look too bad. I just want to kind of get it back to find since we're going to be, this is like a full, full day. I mean, yesterday was a full day. We made it to Vegas at like, what time do we get here? Like 7.30 a.m. Um, so yeah, it was a pretty full day yesterday, but like I said, we didn't do a ton. We just went to breakfast here at the hotel. Um, we went to um, breakfast at Salt and Ivy Bar, something like that. We had pancakes, bacon, it was super good. Um, then after we ate breakfast, we you know got a notification our room was ready. That was probably like almost or close to like 10. So we came in our room, you know, kind of got situated. And then we went to do some shopping. Um, if you're new to my channel, then you may not know this, but my birthday is in a few weeks. I'm a Virgo. And um, y'all know I love Vegas shopping and, you know, wanted to see kind of what they had. Um, so, of course, that 
you know, it's high up on the list. If you come to Vegas um, and you like to luxury shop, this is this is the place. Um, they typically have, you know, things that you can't find in your own city. So that is what I was um, hoping for. So just did a little bit of shopping. I'm not going to show like a Vegas haul, y'all. I'm just going to do one big birthday haul. So my birthday is on the 22nd. So by the end of the month, you all will have that video. So, um, you know, I'm about to, um, in a few weeks, get my hair cut. Um, I don't know what it is, but I kind of want my curls to get back right. And one thing about when you straighten your hair a lot, um, you know, there's risk of heat damage. And I'm someone that doesn't straighten it a lot, but when my hair is straight, I don't like go out my way to like not put heat on it. You know, I would say probably like once a week, but most people, you know, they just straighten their hair and they be like, okay, that's it. No more heat. I'm not really that type of person, but I think I want to cut like, I want to say maybe like two to three inches off, kind of like, like all of that maybe, um, something like that. So we'll see once I go to my stylist, but I've been enjoying wearing my hair curly just because y'all know I'm hot natured. I be sweating in my head. So, um, you know, I kind of don't mind, um, wearing it curly more. So yeah. So we're going to see how it turns out, but yeah, just to revive it, I just, you know, kind of scrunch it up, wet it and go from there. Um, the last time I did like a big curly chop that was, it was like right before I met my husband. It was like 2017. And I was like, okay, I'm kind of just sick of not being able to wear my hair curly. Cause at that point, I mean, it was like, <laughs> it was like, this was curly, this was all straight, like all straight y'all. So I got over it. So I'm like, okay, let's go ahead and you know, get it back right. So that was kind of the shortest my hair really had ever been. Um, and I think, like I said, I think it's time for another chop. But that chop, I mean, y'all, it was a big chop. Like I probably cut like five inches, something like that. It was a big amount. So I think this time, if I cut like two inches for now, maybe cut like another two inches in a few months, that'll get most of my kind of straight ends off so we'll see I ain't gonna make no promises y'all because again it is the fall time so i will be wearing my hair straight at one point or another so we'll see um but yeah this is all that i do and i'm gonna i am gonna put some gel on it today because i do feel like um i need to have some hold because honestly i don't want to do this anymore while we're here so, um, my hair is the kind of hair like sometimes, you know, it'll hold well and then sometimes it won't. It just really depends, um, on like the, the weather. And in Atlanta, it's been really hot. So, yeah. But yeah, we're here. We got here yesterday, Thursday. So, we're here. It's obviously Labor Day weekend. So, of course... Y'all know this is a good weekend to be in Vegas for like, you know, the clubs, a lot of artists and stuff are gonna be here. So tonight we may go to Dre's. Um, Rick Ross is gonna be there. So we, we may do that. I haven't decided because pretty much all the clubs here tonight have some type of artist. Um, so I'm sure we're gonna get, you know, that type of experience no matter where we go so but that's kind of the plan that I have for us to do that yeah but yeah this is all I do to revive it back y'all and like I said it's not too bad it was just like really this this side of my hair was like super frizzy yesterday and I'm just like okay and because my hair even though it's not soaking wet it takes time to dry once I wet it. So I'm like, let's just do it early. So by the time we get out and about, 
it's not wet um this morning i want to go to fashion show mall so i can go in zara um if you know me y'all know i'm a planner and i have no type of outfits at all in mind for my birthday like nothing <laughs> nothing like literally nothing okay um so i might have a couple pieces to work with but like actual like yeah this is like one outfit i could wear i don't I have a full outfit in mind at this point so um i want to see if i can find because as y'all know the czars in atlanta they be hit and miss and i really don't want to buy nothing online because i'm not in the mood for dang this ain't work out i'm not in the mood for that so i feel like if i buy something online and my birthday is now it's the first so now i am three weeks away from my birthday mm -hmm. yeah it's too late to be buying something online at this moment i need to buy it in store to be safe so we're gonna see if i find anything the good thing is if i go in store right and i see something and let's say they don't have my size at least i know the vibe of the you know the item you know when you just order online you don't know what you're gonna get and one thing about zara models the models don't be <laughs> always giving so you don't really know like what you gonna end up with fooling with them so um that's why it's important to kind of see their pieces in store if you ask me so you know like okay yeah i want this um but yeah but yeah gotta find something y'all something because right now it's given what are you wearing <laughs> um but yeah so y'all see it don't take really a lot of time to do this um and like i said it wasn't too bad on this side it was really this side that got really frizzy um but yeah i always get asked and i know it's because obviously i have heat damage i always get asked like is that a twist out no no it's not y'all it's not a twist out it's just your girl puts heat on her hair so of course the curls are not as tight as they really could be um i didn't even know because like i said i've been putting heat on her for so long I didn't even know that my curls could get tight until I did that big chop. And like, you know, just after wearing it curly for so long, it was like, wait a minute, these are some ringlets. Like I had ringlets. It wasn't just no waves, but I wasn't used to that because like I said, at one point in my life, I was very much, I used to straighten my hair every week. Um, so I was definitely not caring about, oh, what the curls look like so so we're gonna clip this side because i'm gonna put like some gel as my second layer but um this side is done and like i said so y'all can see over here this side is just way more frizzy so it's gonna kind of wet it down some I like to wet it down a little then put some oil but yeah I think once I get get a little bit cut, it'll look better. So, but yeah, I'm gonna keep doing this, y'all. And that's really it. I'll probably come back on once um once we are what is it? Once we are headed out. Once I get dressed, like I said, it's early as hell. So right now it's just me kind of wanting to this and get my hair but y'all see like up in there you see how like tight those are so that's why i need all that like at least that much off so you can really see the tightness but yeah but okay i'm gonna talk to y'all a little bit later so i can finish up this hair <laughs> so hey y'all we are about to get out and about i'm not gonna take my camera with me because y'all can't fit in my purse and I'm not lugging this around, so we will film off of our phone. We're just about to go play on some slots, maybe get a drink, go shopping. And yeah, just chill for the day um, until later on this evening. So I'll just bring my phone with me and show y'all what we got going on. I had 200 
us for lunch. Last night I fought on a cunt. 24 shows in a month. Good day that time it was crunch. Ice, diamonds is crunching. Louis B, but my t-shirt is tough. Cold as a slash. Belly rinse so I'm sipping a test. Go get it up, must. Fuck up, good enough, pussy, no must. Love and I lust. My crew loyal. These like these probably comfortable. Oh, these kind of hard. I like those. Yeah. I feel like you got a lot of high tops that you haven't worn yet. Why would they make these? No. Oh, they have these for men. And they have women. We should get something like that so we can match. He already has these, so kind of doing a lot. That is so fire. I don't know, you know, the detail is really cute, but I don't have to have that. So hey y'all, it is Saturday. Yeah. Um please excuse the lighting. It looks horrible right here. Let me see if I go stand somewhere else. It's like by the window it might be better. Yeah, the lighting is just not that great in this room. Um I think I've told y'all and y'all saw the rope the other day. We're staying at Aria. Um, it's been cool here. It's been cool. We called a pretty decent deal. Um, and that's why we chose to stay here. Um, obviously it's Labor Day weekend. So typically, you know, Vegas can be a little expensive, but, um, it wasn't too bad, um, for a four day, three night stay. So we got here Thursday and we are leaving tomorrow morning. So Sunday morning and it's been a good trip y'all. Like we haven't done a ton. Um, this is my seventh time in Vegas. So because I've been here so many times, I've done like all of the, you know, the things that are like popular to do. And this trip, I was like, you know, let's not really have a real strict itinerary and let's just kind of go with it. Let's just have fun and see how it goes. Um, obviously, when you come to Vegas shopping, especially if you love to luxury shop, obviously that is a priority for me. Um, and of course, going to some really good restaurants. So last night, we went to Toca Madeira. I think that's how you say it, Toca Madeira. So good. Now, I'll tell you, when I looked at the reviews, um, a lot of people were complaining about the two hour limit. Y'all, just keep in mind, when you go to these dent restaurants that are popular, that are kind of like entertaining, have music, especially for me, since I live in Georgia, so I'm used to going places and them saying okay you have an hour and a half limit you have a two hour limit now typically if you're just with one other person um two hours is pretty lengthy you know i think we were there probably like an hour and 30 minutes maybe a little longer because we literally had appetizer through dessert 
um, but for the most part two hours is more than enough if you ask me for two people now once you get the bigger parties I can see where um, saying it can only be <laughs> it can only be you know two hours I can see where it get a little bit hectic but yeah um, really really good experience um, after that we were gonna go to Dre's but um, we got a notification about something being canceled we just was like well screw it then we were thinking about going to the Jewel nightclub which is with inside of Aria um, but honestly after we left dinner we both were just kind of like and eh. we went and played on some slots for a little bit and then we came back up to the room and chilled I don't know if it's because you know i live in eastern time zone now and all the other times i've ever came to vegas i came from central because because i lived in tennessee but them three hours difference <laughs> been kicking my butt like i've been waking up at like five and then i want to go to sleep at like 10 but at 10 that's one our time you know so yeah that i just haven't gotten used to that like i said i don't feel like it felt as big of a difference when i was on central time zone but now that I'm on Eastern, it just feels like it's been too long. Um, but we are actually, so I did my makeup. Um, I got to take my hair down. But we are going to um, catch today. So we're going there for brunch at 12. It's like 11, probably like 11, 15. Um, so all I got to do is put my clothes on, take my hair down. Um, we're going to get down there a few minutes early so I could try to get some footage, maybe take some photos. I don't know. Um, I'm pretty sure that brunch is probably really popular when walking to our restaurant last night because Toco Madero is inside the Crystal Shops, which is right next to Aria. Um, it was a lot of people. <laughs> and because it's so like aesthetically pleasing, a lot of people were trying to take pictures. So we're gonna see if I can get pictures, but obviously I'm gonna get some content. Um, after that, I wanna go to the Caesar Shops today because I, like I told y'all, I still have not figured out anything to wear for my birthday. Um, so I do want to kind of check around and see. I didn't have any luck in the Zara here. My husband found a couple of items, but I didn't find anything that just gave anything of what I'm looking for. Um, and obviously, um, the weather's warm still. So yeah, I got to just figure that out. But we're going to see. Um, and then we have reservations at Yardbird tonight. My husband and I, we've been there before. I think we went there... It wasn't my birthday in 21 when we came. It probably was like either 2019, I think 2019, and they just had the best like chicken. So we're gonna go there tonight for dinner. Um, but our flight is early in the morning, so I don't know, you know, what else we're gonna get into. Um, oh, it's been raining here in Vegas also. So I wanted to do a beach club yesterday, but because of the rain, we did not do that. Um, I'm looking over here at Vadera's pool and it's not like a lot of people out. I mean it's early obviously but this weather is cloudy so I think it's gonna rain again so but yeah so I'm gonna stop chatting. I'm gonna show y'all this view. Um, we didn't pay for any extra features. We just did the the deluxe king room which is like a standard room for Aria um, and it's a, it's a decent view but yeah I'm gonna show y'all that um, and slide my clothes on and then I'll come back. Okay y'all so this is the view we have again did not upgrade or anything like that this is just the deluxe king room and obviously aria is really close to cosmo badera um bellagio we took the tram to bellagio the other day i didn't record any of that but um that was my first time getting on it was cool i want to kind of go on cosmo today because i want to go to the chandelier bar we went there when we came in 21 so if i don't get a chance to go that's fine it's just really pretty it ain't nothing crazy special but it's just pretty in there um and yeah, like I said, the only thing was yesterday we really couldn't do a lot of walking because of the raining. So that kind of ruined some of the like, you know, strip experience. But again, this is my seventh visit, my husband's fourth. I'm gonna be okay. <laughs> and here, oh, there's the tram I was talking about. Let me zoom in, y'all. There it is. So yeah, so we took that yesterday. Um, or was it Thursday? I think Thursday, y'all. I'm sorry, I'm confusing the days. But yeah, it, it's cool. It kind of just helps you from having to obviously get to walk in or figure out how to get out of your place to get to the next um, resort casino. So yeah. All right, let's go get dressed. Like a million views in a day 
There's so many ways to get paid. I tried to pay, he begged me to stay. Babe, I'm not staying, I just wanna play. In the party, he just wanna rock. Big boobs in the bus, they pump. So y'all we just got back from catch and i know i've seen a lot of like weird reviews about catch some saying you know it's really good some saying eh. we had a really really good experience we went during brunch hours and y'all it was fire everything was good i had the um catch roll super good the crispy shrimp y'all fire okay get that um, husband had the pancakes and bacon and then we got the truffle fries at the end and yeah all that was good so um i definitely feel like you should go i don't know about all the other catch locations but in vegas it's good so i'm like sitting for just a few minutes <laughs> to just kind of let my food fully digest and then we're gonna get ready to go over to caesar's palace um like i told y'all i want to go to h m aritzia and all those places so We'll be back soon once we get moving. <laughs> you look handsome. <laughs> Almost four now. Till next time, my favorite kitty.